Welcome. Did you know that EdgeCam has free knowledge-based machining strategies? Yes, we're talking about free stuff that will help you reduce or practically eliminate repetitive tasks. Tasks like rough and finished turning and OD grooving. Let us show you what we're talking about. We'll start by dragging and dropping the native 3D solid CAD file into EdgeCam. This illustrates that there is no need for translators. If you're translating anything, something is going to be lost, for translators are not 100% accurate. That is why EdgeCam uses a native kernel to load the part files. The benefit? 100% accurate models. EdgeCam's automatic feature recognition is great. It will interrogate the solid to find the manufacturing features, in this case the turn profiles. Now, just with any CAM system, we could drive the tools manually, getting the results we wish. But that is old technology. What you're going to see is the new standard on how to programming using knowledge-based manufacturing. Simply pick the strategy, in this case we have placed them on a toolbar, which feature you like to machine, right click and done. So the strategy has added the machining instructions required, the tools were selected, the stock queried, speeds and feeds chosen, toolpath applied based on the proven methods. Now that we have the roughing done, let's go ahead and apply a finishing pass. Again, pick the strategy from the toolbar to apply the finish turn toolpath. Again, it goes through the same logic of picking the tool, selecting the speeds and feeds, and applying the toolpath accordingly. Applying the groove is just as easy. The strategy looks at the groove width, picks a tool accordingly, and applies the toolpath. Fast, easy, and consistent. Now take this in the simulator to confirm the manufacturing process. So in review, we've loaded a part, identified the manufacturing features, loaded it into a two-axis lathe, used runtime strategies to program it, which EdgeCam allows anyone to use a strategy. It's a free option that can be added to your system. This option will allow you to view and run any strategy. There is also a module that will allow you to author your own strategies. These runtime strategies use manufacturing methods that are common across our customer base. The technology is also available for milling and a full range of turning. The NC code is the ultimate product of a CAM system. How quick you get there is a valuable measurement. Edge CAM strategies deliver speed, but also includes quality, consistency, and being dynamic to the current CAD model. We'll move to a second part. This illustrates that the strategies are dynamic to the model. The machine process and the logic is what is captured, not how it relates to just one part. The same strategies are applied. Again, it goes through the method of selecting the tool, speeds, feeds, depths of cut, and applying it to the new model. Now there is something a little different with this part. As you've seen, the strategy works on a two-axis lathe. Now this part is on a more complex machine. The strategy has the knowledge of the machine kinematics. This one has a B-axis and will require specific tooling. The logic has been built into the strategy to provide a consistent solution. This machine and the strategy takes advantage of the B-axis by loading the tools on a 45 degree, which will allow the machine to use a much stronger tool. Again, the consistency and flexibility of the strategies are making the job much easier, quicker, and consistent. Okay, what we're going to do now is step it up a notch. We're going to take a second sequence. It's the same part loaded on a more complex machine. This is a four-axis machine with a B-axis head. We're going to be applying the exact same strategies to this part. The strategies know the machine kinematics with the requirements to do all the turning on the lower turret. Even though the machine requirements are different, the strategy still goes through the same logic, selecting the tools, selecting the speeds and feeds, and applying a consistent toolpath. Now, since this machine has the capability, we're going to go ahead and apply the holes to the upper turret. And again, the strategy knows to put all the tooling for milling in the upper turret and you can see the synchronization is automatically added. So we'll move into the simulator to see our results. So a quick review. We've had two parts in three different machines. 
The same strategies were used on all. The strategy selected the tool, loaded them in the appropriate turret, selected the correct speeds and feeds, the correct toolpath, and applied them quick, easily, and consistent. And as you can see in this last example, the lower turret will rough and finish turn and then groove and then release the upper turret to drill the holes. So as you can see, the strategies can greatly improve your throughput by reducing your programming time. But don't stop there. Being able to apply consistent programming methods will also improve your program quality, which will reduce your setup times on the shop floor. This concludes this session. Thank you for your time and I encourage you now to contact your local reseller and inquire about the runtime strategies and how they can start working for you.